Welcome back to the channel. My name is Jared. And in this video, I'm going to share with you how to leverage the powerful color correction tools that are built in Ecamm. So whether you're using it to record a video like I am right now or making a podcast or live streaming, you can get the perfect image each and every time. You know, if I didn't leverage these color correction tools that are built within Ecamm, my image would actually look like this. So stick around because I'm going to show you how to get the perfect image every time. Let's jump straight into live demo mode and I'm going to show you how to use the color correction tools in Ecamm. When you're in Ecamm, this is how you pull up those powerful color correction tools. We're going to click on the wand looking button right here. This is the camera effects section. We'll go ahead and open that. First thing you want to do is make sure you have the right camera selected. So if you have multiple different camera inputs going into the computer, this is where you would choose the one that you want to color correct. I only have one, so it's the CamLink 4K. We're going to skip the, the green screen, the zoom and pan, because we're not dealing with any of that. We just want to see the color correction tools. And they're right down here labeled picture settings. So we can adjust the brightness, the temperature, uh, the tint, the saturation, and the gamma. And this is the powerful tool. We can actually input a LUT. So that's what I have right now. My camera, I'm shooting on the Blackmagic uh, Pocket Cinema Camera 6K, and I always just have it set to log. So if I didn't have this camera LUT, it would look like this. All you got to do is hit select LUT and pull up wherever you have your LUTs saved. I have a presets folder, and I can just go ahead and find all my LUTs. Let's actually just pull this back up because I know exactly where they are here. Uh, go to my Gen 5 Color Science for the Blackmagic, and I like to use the Rec. 709 with plus one contrast. Bam. My image looks great. And you can actually adjust the gamma. I do. I do positive four because I like to crush those blacks a little bit. But, you know, I could lighten up those blacks or I can make them a little bit darker. Saturation. I like to up the saturation a little bit so I look a little bit tanner and not so pasty white. Um, and then, again, we can adjust the tint. Let's go ahead and set that back. The temperature. I'm not going to adjust that. Let's go ahead and put that back to zero. And then you can adjust the brightness too. So we can have the, the brightness if we need to adjust the exposure, exposure or bring it down. We're just going to go ahead and keep that at zero. So very simple to color correct a log image. Just import that conversion LUT if you have one. But what if you're not filming in, in log, streaming in log? You don't need a conversion LUT. Actually, if you have a regular profile, <laughs> turned on and you put in a conversion LUT, it's going to look just really, 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 really bad. It's actually going to look like this here. I'll, I'll show you. Just wait one second. A few moments later. So yeah, this, this looks horrible. I mean, this is what it would look like if you're using a standard picture profile and putting a conversion LUT. So let's turn off the conversion LUT in Ecamm. So this is what the basic picture profile out of the Blackmagic looks like. Let me actually reset the saturation and the gamma, and this is what the standard would look like. And it's okay, but it needs a little bit of work. So let's dive back into live demo mode. So we want to adjust this image. So before you adjust brightness, tint, temperature, saturation, gamma, anything, if we have a, a LUT we wanna to use to kind of give us that stylistic look that we're looking for, you wanna input that first before you mess with anything. So let's choose a LUT I wanna use. And I'm going to go back to presets and I want to use Leela's LUTs. Leela is a creator on YouTube. She has an awesome uh, LUT pack and I like the cool kid. Now, initially when you use a LUT, they're a little too powerful when you're using these look LUTs and not a conversion LUT. So we can actually dial it back right here. We can go from 100% to zero. And so I would just start dialing it back to taste. I like this one to be at about 40-ish percent. Now, I, I know I wanna up the saturation a little bit, so let's up the sat saturation to about 10. Again, I like to crush the blacks a little bit, so let's up the gamma a little bit to about, to about right there. I think that looks, that looks good. So whether you're filming in log or you're filming in a standard picture profile, you can use the powerful color correction tools in Ecamm to get the perfect image, the perfect look that you're looking for 
perfect look that you're looking for each and every time. So if you want to try out Ecamm, there's a link down in the description. Try it out free for 14 days. And if you want to save 15%, use the code Jared15 at checkout and save yourself 15%. All right, guys, that's it for this one. I will catch you in the next video.